How's it going, everyone? Thanks for joining us on CNY Central. I'm First Alert Meteorologist Mike Brookins. It's Easter weekend, late March, and we're looking better, a lot better than what we had during the week with temperatures below average and a uh, chance for snow showers and flurries. We've got uh, maybe nothing exciting going on, but uh, far from par, we're going to be pretty mild here. 40 to 50 degrees during the morning, eventually making the mid and possibly upper 50s in some spots on Easter Sunday. A mostly cloudy sky will start off with partial sunshine and as we work towards midday, more overcast sky. And I think it's the second half, you know, Easter afternoon when we start to bring in a chance for rain. So pretty quiet in the morning, bit of a brisk breeze developing. Let's review the almanac, then we'll get deeper into our seven day forecast. That was just a little glimpse in the big holiday period. A lot of people going to Easter Sunday services or Easter egg hunts early on. 33 hour temperature last night. That was above average by three degrees. We were four degrees above average for our high. So pretty similar number there as far as differential. Uh, normal high temperatures 49. We'll be close to that normal low of 30 tonight. Record high though. Boy, wouldn't that be nice? 87 back in 1986. No snowfall for today. Monthly total about two inches above average and close to a foot and a half below average. Our seasonal total. Here's what we expect tonight. No snow, no rain, not much weather going on with high pressure with us. It's mainly clear. There'll be some patchy clouds early and then late and rather cool about where we should be though. Easter Sunday, it's a mild midday and afternoon, but we may not be able to enjoy those milder temperatures during the PM hours with rain developing. The first half and midday look best for outdoor activities. Monday, windy, cooler, and we're going to bring in a chance for snow already. Probably nothing sticking here on Monday, but that could be changing as we head into Tuesday in some spots. Let's show you the satellite radar and very quiet. Great to see the sunshine. I think it lifts up a lot of people's spirits. Thanks to this area of high pressure, a lot of sinking dry air. That high is going to be drifting right over us tonight. That delivers light winds and a mainly clear sky. Some of these high thin clouds will start to drift in during the late night hours. And those are the clouds we're going to be stuck with a lot of the day come Sunday. Precipitation way out to the west in Iowa, Illinois, going down into Kentucky. That's going to be moving on in as well. So we'll probably find deteriorating conditions. I'd put it that way. Nice and clear at two o'clock in the morning. Then we start to get some high thin clouds. And those clouds may make the temperature go up late at night. Partial sunshine early, then we're overcast and eventually leading to some showers. The wind also picks up. It turns breezy and mild in the afternoon and pretty rainy for the finish of the day. This bout of rain will move off and taper to isolated showers overnight. Come Monday, just a few rain and snow showers with temperatures falling, maybe 42 and falling as we work through the day there. So we'll enjoy our 56. Not going to see a number like this for the next seven days after this Easter Sunday. Hour by hour forecast. Look at these temperatures. They fall like a rock during the evening with light winds and the clear sky, dry air. 35 at midnight with a clear sky. Now we'll start to see some high thin cloudiness, probably even before 3 a.m., 1 or 2 o'clock in some spots to the west southwest. That means we drop to 31, then the temperature goes up late at night. 33 at 5 a.m., 6 a.m., 34. Those clouds thickening as we go through the morning. If you want to see any sun, it'll be early in the day. About the time of those Easter egg hunts. Some spots could be a little frosty early on, so you'll need a jacket. As we go into the midday, though, nice milder temperatures getting up to 56. It'll be breezy in the afternoon, wind out of the south, fighting those showers that move on in. Scattered at first, more of like a numerous uh, showery pattern or some rain towards the late afternoon or evening. A few passing rain and snow showers on Monday. Then we'll find lake effect snow showers north of Syracuse on Tuesday. Otherwise, some spotty flurries and windy and chilly. It's going to resemble more like winter on Tuesday.